Dang it. Man, I trapped myself. Now I don't even know how to get to my own chair. You guys asked for deer? There he is. What's up, deer? How you been? Took you long enough to get me out of that dusty corner. Ha! Huh. All right. In that case, maybe I have to crawl under the table. If you're new here and you're wondering why I'm talking to this thing, he's deer, man. Been around with the channel for a long time. Right? Right, dear? That's right, Scotty. I was here before you were. What are we talking about anyway? Why are we all talking about living for? Okay, just be quiet now, because it's time to go through these catalogs. What's up, you guys? Welcome back to Pick Me Up, Scotty. I'm Scotty, and yeah, there's cables and wires and cameras up here. I, I sort of readjusted that camera there, so we can go through this. Second batch of catalogs. You guys enjoyed the last one so much, and whoa, the video is doing really, really well. You guys put all your comments in there. Thank you for liking the video. And welcome all you new subscribers. You know, I'm just having some fun with some alternative big brands. And yeah, let's check out some more here, right? But before I get into that, final thoughts about Lepin. I am reading all your comments. You know, I reply to you guys. It's really interesting to hear that they may come back later with a different name, or they already have, and have new factories. Who knows? But let's not forget that there are other brands out there that are doing exactly what Lepin does, but on a much smaller scale. There's tons of them out there, man. They copy the same logo as well. There's like Lele, there's 818, there's tons, man. Here's a couple of screenshots that I found just in my local shopping mall. Lego, you gotta go after these guys. LY, OBM, Ninja Cube, really? Yeah, so, you know, Lego's gotta work really hard to get rid of them too. But let's hope that what you see here are originals. There are some that have me scratching my head going, really, they put that in here? Well, let's have some fun and check it out, right? If you have any other brands you want me to look into, let me know in the comments below. I'll check them out if I can. I just need more time. I need more clones of myself. Man, not enough time. All right, let's push this aside and start with the small one first. Uh-oh, right there. That looks really wrong. That's already a red flag. Man, you're next. Good luck, Lego. Go find them. But underneath that, they're also known as L or U. Man, they should just hire me to come up with new names for these big brands. Really? Microbic looks okay. I've never heard of these guys. Have you guys heard of them? So Microbic probably means that, yes, these are nano blocks. Can you see that? There we go. These guys do nano brick styles. We're just gonna go through this real quick. Animals, creatures, and you know, like I said, I don't know if they have the rights to do like SpongeBob, but they have these if you're into nano blocks. A lot of people are not into nano blocks. I personally love nano blocks. I have no problems with them. We'll review those really soon. But let's go through this. Yeah. Uh oh. Disney characters. Another red flag. Marvel characters. Yeah. Endgame Avengers. Architectures. There we go. You know, pause the video if you can because we got a lot of catalogs to go through and I can't show these too long. Those will take forever. Pokemon. Ships. Yeah. So, that's cute. A little bear in the spa. Battlefield ones again. This stuff doesn't really interest me. They're too small. And then vehicles and brickheads. Uh oh, spaghetti. -o. I don't know if those are like allowed or not. But anyway, there you go. Lego, QR read that and go after them. All right, next. What's next? Yes. Never heard of these guys before. They're called Quan Long Education. These guys are actually really, really cool. They're really talkative. They really want our support. So I may review some of these. Let me know which one looks interesting to you. These ones, however, are more educational. You know, it's good to have kids thinking and putting bricks together. Again, many of these brands do have their own Duplo styles. So whether or not Duplo bricks are free range copyright, I don't know. No one's answered me that yet. Anyone know? Is it patent? No? We'll keep moving on. There's the next page. Yeah, okay. I'm going to go through this faster. Some Duplo looking Technic pieces. That's interesting. Not my cup of tea. Not my thing. We'll keep moving. More Duplos. We got farm animals. We got, now we're coming to the mechanical parts. Here we go. Construction. Happiness town. Interesting. Another one. More animals. Animals and more animals. How big is Duplo? Is Duplo really popular or not? I don't know. More Duplo stuff for kids. There's the train. We got some food. The food looks pretty good. That's interesting. I guess you can make that with your own Duplo bricks. It's all kitty stuff, man. Uh-oh, we're getting into police Duplo. Fire station Duplos. Ah, so this is where the cool stuff actually comes in. This is actually pretty interesting. And this is what they're really enthusiastic about. It's these sets. These are like, look, 19 in one. They have 19 in ones. They have 20 in ones. Basically, it's all these Technic pieces where you have like an electronic device 
you can control these sets, you can make some machines like that, robots and vehicles. It's kind of cool, it's different. You know, gymnastic robot. Looks like Johnny number five, short circuit again. Oh, Wally, do you guys find anything interesting here? Let me know. Oh, it looks like the menu is in Chinese though. I don't know if that can be switched to English. Hopefully they can. If we get enough people interested in this and we support these kind of brands, it's totally possible, man. Keep going and that is it, the windmill. Thanks, Quan Long. Who is next? Ah, this is the one all you guys have been asking about too. This is Kada or Kada. Aka, Kada, Kada. I'm just visiting these guys. The booth was actually really huge. They're mostly Technic pieces, so they're kind of like the Technic side of Lego, but they try to do original. You guys let me know, look at the catalog here and see what you think. So Mini Sam, who works for me, actually bought a gun, so we're gonna try to review that. I'm gonna let him build that and I'll review it for you guys. And let's open this up and see what else we've got. Yeah, we'll start with this first. We'll go like this. There. There we go, look at that. He also bought this one, I'm interested. These are remote control, by the way. And if you get a chance, go check out Johnny's World YouTube channel. I'll put the link in the description and the card up here. He has a lot of cool reviews and he does a lot of kata too. Unfortunately, it's not in English. Damn it, that means I have to do the reviews for you guys in English too, right? Anyway, let's move on here. Now this is cool, you got a pig and the lucky cat and they do move, the ears move and the arms go up and down. I think the ears too. Not quite sure on that one, on the cat. But that's cool. They got some dinosaurs there. Fairground. Interesting, not interesting. How about this? Ooh. It's like an all-in-one, ten-in-one. I've actually never really been a fan of the all-in-one because I end up just building one. I don't want to take it apart and build the other ones. I don't know why. But if anything, I would just probably build the biggest one that you can see. And that looks kind of cool. That's different, yeah. But look at that. I'm interested in the Santa Claus. I think that looks really cool. The vehicles actually look pretty okay. This one looks very similar to something I've seen before. I like the pickup truck. That's cool. Bulldozers, military ones here. The motorcycles actually look really good. Let me come over here to this side. There's the guns, look at them guns. I think a majority of people that like Kata actually really like the guns and here they are. And you know, yeah, I know guns is a very touchy subject, but that is kind of cool. I think it's really cool that you can actually piece it together, making it with bricks. In this case, it's more Technic style. I do have a couple guns I've built. I'll do a couple of reviews and you guys let me know what you think, yeah? All right, let's move on. Next catalog. Never heard of these guys before. Here they are. These guys are called Kuao Le Tong. Kuao Le Tong? Kuao? Kiao? Kiao Le Tong? There's probably a Chinese way to pronounce it. I don't know. If I can't read Chinese, I know, I'm a disgrace. But this is a nice looking cover, yeah, it's pretty cool. All right, let's open this up. Oh man, it's more of these little guys, not my thing. So if you guys have been buying from my store, you know sometimes I'll throw in a little gift, sometimes I'll throw in a figure, and sometimes I'll throw in like these little guys. I think they're actually really cool for gifts. But as for collectors, nah, it's not my thing. But here, more military, military, red elite. That look familiar to you? Red alert, CNC, oh no. No idea if that's copyright or an inspiration maybe. You got more police, police, police. I'll count to two seconds, that's enough for you to pause this. One, two, construction, one, two. Where's the bigger stuff, man? We need the bigger stuff here. Oh, the fire stuff actually looks pretty okay. Oh, cool pirate themes. I actually really love pirate stuff. I know there's tons of Lego ships. I want to get to those, but I just don't know when I have the time to. But maybe eventually I'll get there. Ooh, more pirates. Jurassic Legend. Oh no. At least they didn't call it Jurassic Park. And I don't know if these are actually real true knockoffs to the sets that exist out there. Quayle Tong. Better be careful. Guess who's coming after you? Looks interesting. Maybe you guys like the dinosaur. And look, Nikita Wells. You're into the fossil stuff? There's one right here. I like this lab looking place. That's kind of neat. All right. Scientific expedition? Snow stuff? Any fans of the snow theme stuff? This is more my style, but it is 
kind of a girly look to it. Look, makeup table, three different ways. Okay, so maybe that's not my style. You got a grand piano there. Yeah, drum set. Let's move on. Ooh, we're coming to a slightly more modular, but still looks like friends. Someone did mention that these guys don't do their original ideas. Why, man? Why are they copying Lego like Friends, City, Creator? Do your own thing, man. Grow some balls. Come on, I know you can do it. Anyway, there you go. Here, like this. This is space stuff, but it looks simple to me. Too simple. Star Battle. Yeah, here we go. We got some buses here, if you're a bus fan. Look, this one's kind of cool. It's got graffiti all over it. Ah, see, this stuff is more slightly original. Bugs. No cockroaches, thank goodness. Oh no! Well, that's a beetle. Yeah, that looks kind of cool. I like that. I like the dragonfly eyes. Buggy eyes. Okay, these are cool. Mechs. They kind of look like Gundam, but not quite. I wonder how they hold up. Should I get some of these? By the way, whatever you're seeing, if you want to request to have them on my store or check them out or prices, let us know. We'll try to help you out. You guys can find any of these anywhere, I'm sure. But let's move on. Three Kingdoms. I have no idea what this is like an all-in-one again. You buy all these and it transforms into a robot. Oh! Okay, this might be a little bit of a copyright issue. Looks like Transformers. This one, I have no idea. Many mech fans, where are you at? Let me know what you think of these. Ooh, look at that. Why are there so many of these, man? I guess robots are a big thing. Look at that, it's a satellite that turns into a mech. They thought of everything. We saw soccer mech, now we're seeing satellite mech. Yeah, this, is, this looks super ugly, man. Ugly, ugly, nope. Uh, copyright, copyright. Trans, transmutation. Transmutation, more the meets the nose. Ew, sorry guys, man. Who the hell designed that? No. A little bit better, kart racing. That can fold and turn into an airplane. That can go into an F1 formula car. Okay. Ah, city streets. These are starting to look all the same as the other stuff we've seen before. You have your 7-Eleven, Adidas. Of course they call it Aias. Aias, Aias. Buckstar Coffee. Very clever indeed, Buckstar Coffee. That is so funny. And these are like all miniature box sets that you buy as a set. More of those small ones that transform into something bigger. This is interesting. Every brand I think just sells bricks, man. And they look exactly like Lego packaging, the colors and everything. Come on guys, you gotta be original, man. Lego, I guess you're coming after these guys because they're pretty close to you too. But now that is interesting. Look, they got Disney logo, Walmart logo. Huh? I recognize some of these. So maybe they really do have the license to do it here in China and these are not supposed to be sold outside. And that actually got me thinking that maybe Lepin in the past were just more for the people within the region, but somehow because of the power of the internet, Facebook, Amazon, it's become an international thing, so it's made a lot of noise, and boom. Boom! Look at this! You guys know how much I love Bambao? Have you seen that video? Remember? I'll put it right here on the card if you don't see the card. Just go look, just search Bambao. Oh man, that one. But they do actually have a lot of license to some of the characters, and some of them are actually pretty good. We'll start with this one here. And the guys were actually not talkative on that day I went to the expo. They were really quiet, so we just grabbed the book and ran. But now, we have it here. No more mechs. Really interesting to you guys? No, I don't know. This is more like the Technic stuff that you saw earlier. And then more kitty looking ones there. We'll move that out of the way. Let's look at the big guy right here. What's interesting about this picture right here is that it's actually legit. And I'll show you a couple pictures that I have. And maybe I shouldn't be showing these, but it's okay. It's the same photo. It's just real life. Banbao is a huge factory, man. These brands that are popular and doing brick stuff, they're huge. There's not a little hole in the wall during factory runs. Look, Banbao is absolutely massive, and we're gonna find out why by going through this catalog here. These are more of the Duplo stuff again. Can you see that? Yeah, okay, good. Ah, uh, here we go. Peppa Pig. These guys probably made huge amounts of money for having the license to actually do it. So 
The figures here are totally different. I actually really like the cartoon comic characters that figures that these guys make because they're not allowed to do minifigures. So if I'm not mistaken, minifigures are copyright unless they've changed the torso and the arms, which a lot of brands have already done. And Bam Bam has specifically done that for their stuff, which looks totally different, by the way. Look at all that. Oh man. More kid stuff there. This looks like the Friends theme. We got vehicles here. It actually looks kind of cool. Be interesting to see how the minifigures fit to these, but I like this. Ah, uh, the peanut stuff. So you guys seen my review of this one here. I have this one I haven't built yet. And I think I have one more somewhere. It's not on this page. But these are really, really good. I really like these one. Bam Bam bricks are slightly different from Lego bricks, but they're still compatible. They're just like a little bit thicker and it looks different in the feel too. But hey, these ones are okay. More mix. Robots that look interesting, kind of. I don't know, it's like a mixture between friends and I don't know. I hope original. Bam Bow, you better be original. Not again. More police and fire stuff. No, please. Oh, now we're coming to something original. Yeah, no, this look interesting. Car fans, vehicle guys, there you go. Look at Dutch. Underwater theme, submarines, boats, more aircraft carriers. Yeah, these are the Toby guys, man. I just don't like their faces and their, their feet. Weird. Farm. This looks interesting. This looks interesting just because it's big. It doesn't look like it has much of an interior though. Oh, they call it Safari here. Safari, sorry, Safari, it's not a farm. There's the elephant, man. Okay, what else we got? Dinosaurs. Yes, got some dinosaurs there. This is a dinosaur theme, but what the heck is this? This is interesting. Huh, I'm gonna have to look into these. Yeah, let me let me know what you guys think. Architecture. Wow. Okay. Might be interested to check some of these out. Backdrops. You guys wanna buy some backdrops? I'm guessing that's backdrops. Yeah. And look, that and about doing good for the kids, doing some educational stuff. See? Positive. We gotta think positive, man. Look, look at this screenshot. It's like they took a screenshot of a player and just forgot to take out the, the time there. That's funny. I don't know what this is, but that looks really cool. All right, enough of Ban Bao. We gotta keep moving, guys. Look at this. I ain't never heard of these guys before. Block Toys World, Piers, Peja, Peja. Look at the kids so happy. Are you guys smiling like that right now? You better be like that right now, because I'm showing this to you guys. More figures and robots and, you know, I don't know how to describe these things. Soldiers and, it's so random these things. Future police, these are futuristic police. Who thought of an idea of having a guys riding a crocodile? Look at this police station. Okay. Okay, no comment there. More small mini in one things. I'm gonna go through these ones pretty fast. Maybe you guys like this stuff, you know, I don't know. These are really, really tiny though. There's so much stuff just in this one catalog. More police. No, no police stuff, please. Away, away, police. Who buys all this stuff? City rescue. Okay, there. One, two. One, two. Uh, it's getting bigger and kind of interesting there. Oh, construction. Almost looks like the same stuff we're seeing now. Now I'm getting confused. Oh, there we go. Change union. What the heck does that mean? Okay, this is like something I can make. Okay, change union. I'm not interested in change union. If you guys are, it's okay. That's what you like. Change union. There's a lot of change unions here. What is going on? Futuristic dino robots. Change union. Dragon Knight. That looks like a mess right there. Now we're turning into the Jurassic dino stuff. Yeah, Jurassic period. That just sounds wrong, man. I don't know, terrible. Okay, here we go. Pirates again, yes. I'd like to see more pirate stuff come out. Lego hasn't done any more pirate stuff, right, recently? Like, the theme is gone, right? So hey, it's all yours, man. There you go. If you like the pirates, let me know. Yo, ho, yo, ho. A pirate's life for me. More friend stuff again. Happy holidays, they call this one. Happy holidays. 
Now this looks too small. That's pathetic. That's not even a house. This is like a wall with two doors. What's going on? Keep moving. Now we're getting to the bigger stuff. Yeah, but mm, no, yes, no. You want me to review this? Yeah, do I have to? <laughs> Keep moving on. Princess, they're doing this princess theme now. More cars. More vehicles. Star Pioneer. Did they spell Pioneer right? Or is that me? Maybe they did. Maybe that's just me. There you go. P.S. I don't find any copies so far. Interesting, yeah? All right, next. Z Gao and lightning blocks for the kid. Original looking cover. Let's hope these guys are original on the inside, yeah? Here we go. Hello. I can't read that, sorry. Wow. At least the characters are original here. I kind of like the look of this part and these parts. You know, I'm a sucker for the 3D looking stuff, but this looks like it's rendered. Okay, what's here? Tan Tan Meow. Tan Tan Meow. Never heard of these guys. Duplo one. I don't want to see the Duplo stuff. Some cars, still looks very simple. Oh, hospital. Interesting. Not sure what that is. Oh, I remember these guys. Their booth was really weird, man. Like, they had so many people inside. It was super dark, it's really weird. But anyway, they do homes like this, but it looks like they don't have much of an interior. But this is interesting. This is what I'm always suggesting brands to kind of do, like do the furnishings that you can put inside the set so you can have the option to do it. Maybe I should buy this for the Sunshine Hotel. Remember the Oxford Block video I did, that emptiness? This can fill it up. These look like original designs and ideas, maybe inspired by a Chinese cartoon, I'm not sure. But there you go, look at that. Looks evil, castle. Friends, <gasps> Lego, go after them. Oh no, more friends. Castles. Oh, look at this one. 731 pieces. QL1106. I like that size of the castle. And here's some mini ones. For your daughters or for your girls? Yeah. Holy moly, there's a lot. City girl. These guys just copied Jing Bao with their city girl stuff. You see like the scissors? I like that stuff. Iceland colors. Hey, that's an original team name. Iceland colors. Janine Princess. Who's Janine? Never heard of her. That's kind of cool. It looks like a stable. Interesting, interesting design. Oh, 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 oh. This is where we have to think about whether or not this is right or wrong. They don't call it Minecraft, but it's kind of obvious. You know what's interesting? It's this one here. Three in one, but this looks like a creator kind of house. See, I might want to just get this to just see what it looks like with a figure on it. But is it morally right that they didn't call it Minecraft? And I'm not, I'm not going to get it for the characters. But I kind of want it for the, the mock part of it. Yeah? No? You guys let me know. Let's move on. And I don't know if these are original. Maybe Lego makes these. If Lego does, I'll go out and buy the Lego ones. The treehouse looks kind of cool. Interesting. No, more warship battleships. Battleships, more aircraft carriers. Whoa. Police. Six in one. SWATs, helicopters. Whoa, that looks kind of crazy. Tanks. Oh, your military tank lovers. There you go. Xia Giao. Tanks Force. Never heard of these guys. No idea if that's good. Police. More police. This world is big, man. A lot of stuff here. Here we go. Trains, yes, a lot of you are into trains. Let me know if these are original and if you want me to review it. I guess I have to review everything. No matter what I say, the guys would say, review it. Train, more train stuff and more smaller stuff. Here, Duplos, more Duplos. Ah, the table and the chair is actually a pretty cool idea. Every brand is doing that now. 
and happy farm look at that farm is becoming the new trend and i don't know why there you go see ya see ya ah look at this speaking of trains this is from a brand called ky toys and model the train that you're seeing here it's the same train i took to go to the expo it's like a high-speed railway train that's kind of cool i don't know if it's compatible with the lego tracks so we gotta look at the inside here and see, got some tracks you can buy there. This is really cool. I mean, these are really small, but it's nice that, you know, I like the furnishing parts. You have little benches, workstation there. You have the gates to go through. These are probably super, super cheap. They have to be cheap. More here, put in your station, make your own station. Look at the trains, ladies and gentlemen. Let me know what you think of those. This is based on the mail carriers SF. The people that we sometimes mail out to you guys that some of you hate. But anyway, there you go. And I have little miniature model cranes here. Okay, this is interesting. This is called Crater. If you look on the boxes here on the pictures, it's actually Kazi. So I'm pretty sure KY is Kazi as well. So this is from the Kazi booth. Some of you are asking me about that. But I guess I picked up the wrong catalog. It looks like I just picked up train stuff. But lots of trains there. More trains there. That's why you've been buying your Lego trains and you have finding these trains. Here you go, there's another option, that's what I mean. I don't think Lego will ever make these ones. You know, look at that. The power too. And have interiors. Ooh, interesting. Interesting. A lot of trains. Oh man. Oh yeah. KY, I'm pretty sure this is also known as Kazi. So there you go. What's next? Dr. Star. Hmm. Lego, logo, too close. Why are they always doing the red, yellow thing there? Okay, what well you see right here, all the miniature stuff put into little eggs. You buy the box and you just collect them, but they're too small for me. Yeah, stuff like that, six in one. But like I said, this is the kind of the stuff that I'm usually throwing into your gifts when you're buying from us. There. Yeah, they have some characters, Disney characters, Mario characters, copyright, Pokemon. Oh no, you're in trouble. They do have some street stuff here. But like I said, these are nano blocks. They're very, very small, but they also do do a lot of architecture stuff, which is actually really cool. So as I mentioned, these are nano blocks. They're really, really small. They're only like that big, maybe. They, they look bigger than they are in pictures. And that comes to the next one that I'm gonna show you. These guys are very, very tricky with how they promote their stuff. But anyway, that is Dr. Star for you. Dr. Star, your logo is a little bit close to Lego's one. So, you know, they might come after your ass next. Hey, wait, you guys, we have stuff right there. Man, Scotty just can't stop talking. Yada, 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 yada. Let's take a break for right now. And if you see anything that you like, don't forget to find us on breakmeupscotty.com. We'll try to help you find these sets. Yeah, I like them too. And man, there's a lot more to go through. All right, you guys, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and thank you for enjoying the channel. I'll catch you guys next time. Bye-bye now.